Alright. It's time to continue this. I've get up. Since last time was basically just grinding, so I can continue story. I think. Though mind you, this is like heading towards the end of this, but I'm not gonna do this right now. Um, ooh, I didn't swap games. Hold on, quickly. On Twitch, I didn't swap games. There we go. All good. Uh, oh yeah, right, because we're not in this town anymore. We're in Sertenbury. I need to go... I'm doing this to avoid conflict. Right, that was weird. <laughs> Alright, uh, Senamori. That was a lot of grinding last time. Oh. It's actually amusing, but I need to take a taxi now. There we go. Miska, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm I'm sorry. 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 I'm さっきの立石田幹部たちに食事の手配とかやらされてるとこで出所祝いの前夜祭ってかさっきからひっけりなしに出前が出入りしてんのが見えるよえ見えるってあれきちゃもしかして今のう呼ばれる手間は省いてや
強引に聞きやがってじゃあ行くか待ってくれ行くのは俺一人でいい大丈夫だなあみんな俺ここまで付き合ってくれただけでも感謝してんだ今ここで抜けてもらって構わねえんだぜおいおい今更何言ってんだよそんな水臭いこと言われるとなんか悲しいなその通りだ俺ら観光で大阪まで来てるわけじゃねえぞいいもの持ってきたよ What did he find? An amp? おかもちがあったから拝借してきたま、大阪は楽しませてもらったけど俺だって観光に来たわけじゃないよこれでスムーズに侵入できればいいですねみんなありがとうよ Oh, that's that pizza. <laughs> the one that I keep pointing out in every game, practically. Where they have the big slices of tomato instead of pepperoni. It bothers me every time I see it. Okay. Damn, I probably should have healed before this, huh? Oh well. How bad could it get? I wonder if that one's on watch. Most likely. I'm sure they don't want people like us slipping in. It'll be bad news if our cover gets blown, Kasuga. What's the plan? We came this far, didn't we? We keep going. Figured. But let's at least try not to get caught. Yeah, I know. Follow my lead. Oh, uh oh. Stealth. Great. Oh, this is this is going to be annoying, isn't it? Hey, Lolo, thanks for the forty-three months, man. How's it going? Ugh, I suck at stealth, no matter what game. Okay, I gotta wait. I see. Dude. Oh. Okay, maybe it doesn't matter. I thought it was gonna be like a game over or something if I got caught, but this is fine. How sings? Okay, oh damn it. But I got the feeling one of these is gonna be a bait. Things have been naughty, have I been? Oh, I've been okay. Just been worried about the state of my computer. Oh, come on. Given the whole intel thing that's been happening. Uh oh, this guy's tough. Other than that, not a whole lot. Oh, 
Intel thing? Yeah, it's the big deal, but, um... Basically, any computer built within the last two years with, like, 13th or 14th gen processors, they're crashing and um, degrading to a point where, like, they need to be RMA'd. And it's like, you know, I'm not the perfect one to explain it, but they kind of were avoiding responsibility until recently where they fully acknowledged it. But it's like a mix of um, their fault and just motherboard manufacturers doing their own thing. Trying to get power out of it. So it's a bit of a clusterfuck. But eventually it gets to the point where, like, your processor degrades so much that it has to be RMA'd. And I've had... ...a few crashes this week. But they seem to be related to, like, a faulty cable, but it's still doing weird stuff, and I'm not sure. So I'm still in the midst of, like, figuring it out. The weird thing is, like, I've run the stress test to try and bait the issue out. Because there's things you can do to kind of try and force it to crash, so then you go, okay, it's the CPU. But I've tried those, and it hasn't... It hasn't crashed. Which, it could be something completely different, so I don't know. It's been a little bit of a headache. The irony is that it only started happening pretty frequently when... Because they released a BIOS update that's supposed to address the processor being hammered with voltage. Which was causing the instability. But ever since I installed that BIOS, like, I've gotten problems, so I'm not sure. But, like, rolling it back is a bad idea as well, because then it's like, well, I might be cooking the processor inadvertently. The only reason I got Intel was just because I didn't want it to be purely a gaming rig, otherwise I would have gone AMD. Because that's it's definitely better for gaming. But, yeah, I mean if it ends up being the CPU, lesson learnt. Anyway, that's that's me. <laughs> How are you? I need to be in stealth, but I'm, I'm it's just like I find stealth sections so annoying. But Dodgy's still taking a lot of damage despite having the new armor. Okay. Honestly, not a bad idea to do. Security seems to have calmed down. Let's try not to get caught.
You flew to California to meet with your brother, and you drove over a thousand miles in two days to meet in with him. With you back in Washington. What? Damn. It's a heck of a trek. I should probably save. Let's save just in case I butcher this. Oh, you can't save? Okay, well. I guess my save is like what I got up to. This is. I'm gonna hate this. I might just load. <laughs> it gets too annoying. This first one's a freebie, so it's fine. I see how it is. It gets tougher and tougher. Every time you get caught. You'd never been on a drive more than a couple of hours. Damn. That must have been an experience. I mean, if we were your brother, it was probably fun. Okay. To constantly check the map. I really don't like this. <laughs> Just because the engagement radius is, is massive. Oh, ah! Dude, did he just go around that quickly? Okay. This is this is so annoying. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna load. After this fight, if I fail, I have to load. Yeah, I'm trying, but... Man, the radius they engage you at is massive. There's no sneak either. Just have to keep doing this. This is gonna turn around. Excuse me. Okay. It's not over. Oh, did you see that um, Risk of Rain 2's DLC comes out in a few days? Hang on. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, the chef's gonna get at it. Gonna be fun. Yeah. I'm curious what else they're gonna add to it. This is not the way. Um, we're making a right. down. Okay. Okay, I think I got it. Please no more. Ooh. Hell of a door. Think this is the dragon chamber? Not like anywhere else. Look the part. Guess we'll find out. Then let's go. Okay. All right, I got some tungsten. I'll probably be checking it out on the day that it releases. 
開けてみるかいたぜ If you're around and wanna like do some stuff with it. But I got the feeling one of these is gonna contain a dude. No, wait, what is that? That's a defense increase. Symbolic of a devotion to training for a real man's man. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, Risk of Rain was like... Just classic. Oh, and I got an ROG Ally X, which is like a Steam Deck competitor. And I've been jamming some games off stream. Like, I've been doing some Baldur's Gate, just trying to play it single player. Because didn't really get far in it. いや、どうなんすかね。今日は皆さんお忙しいようですし、俺ら直接入っていいって言われたんですけど。そんなわけあらへん。よそ者が勝手にうろついて場所と違うで。誰に大公の部屋に入ってって言われたんや。どこの国
よしこれでいい行こうぜいやなちょっと never really been one to sleep that early Are you kidding? Oh shit. Wait, what? Why are they here? Yeah, I've said this before. It's like, I like that people find comfort in the streams and can chill and relax to the point where they fall asleep, but. I will never actively do something for someone to achieve that because that's not really what I'm here to do. <laughs> but if, you know, what I am doing allows that for you without me doing any specific effort for you, then I am very happy for you. Why are they here? Brutal? It's honest. I'd say it to anyone that says that. Or like, hey Will, say something funny. Do something funny. Do the funny voice! Oh, he's heard of him. Classic Majima. You're gonna have to fight me, yep. Why does he look younger? <laughs> he looks way younger than the previous time he was in the game. Oh god, this fight's gonna suck. I mean, it's gonna be fun, but it's gonna suck. <laughs> He's got his own theme music. Ugh. Oh god, he's level 50. Okay, I'm pulling out all the stops. Oh, you- Oh! Hang on, it's not allowed on this. i am got the wrong character. False alarm. Yeesh. Uh-oh. This is a problem. Um, let me think. Alright, do this. Oh my god, that does nothing. Am I intended to lose this fight? Why do I get the feeling this is going to send me back to grind? Mm. 
Okay, but it's only recovering her HP. Okay, uh, he's gonna have to heal. I hope this is a joke fight, because this is kind of scary. Alright, Adachi. I'm gonna have to try and stun him. No. Um, I doubt status afflictions will work on him. I think I need to conserve his mana just to heal. Dude. Right, I'm gonna buff her. I'm very worried about this fight. What? What? Whoa! What the hell is this? Uh, oh no, I'm, I'm gonna lose this. <laughs> What the hell, man? No, this, this has got to be a comedy fight. Surely. If all those shadows do damage, I'm screwed. Alright, let's try this. I'm, I'm, I'm screwed. <laughs> There's no way I can win this. I was having trouble with one of them, like I can't outheal this. I wonder if I should just cave and just let the fight. Just throw the fight. This feels insanely unfair. I was confident with one, but four of them. It'd be fine if the illusions vanished, but I used Nanba's special. And it did nothing. This has got to be a joke fight, like you're intended to lose. I'm just gonna let it go, like... There's no way I can win this. Oh wait, Kasuga got knocked out, and then it's over. No? What the hell? Um. Hold on.
that seems really far. Yeah, I'm very under leveled for it. <laughs> they said the recommendation for it is level 38, sorry, 48 ish. What the hell, really that big of a discrepancy? Um, hmm. I don't know what I'm gonna do. All right. Um, I guess let's do some of these. Well, it's understandable. It's just usually with the other... Wait, didn't bring up the dialogue. Weird. Usually with the other games in the series, you don't have to grind that much. This one has required me to do a lot of grinding. Alright, this dude wanted toilet paper, so it's not even a fight. Um, I'm just going to go around town and just attend to these. It might be because I've been avoiding combat. In some areas, but... <sighs> Man. Even with doing the battle tower for like an hour. I'm still not in a good place. Alright, well, this, this might be another grind session. I might not play it for that long. We'll see. I did want to make progress today, but not like this. Wait, there's a sub-story here. Did I beat the tiger off screen? No. No, no, no. Oh, I don't know if I got it or not. Yeah, okay, let's do this. おい、おい、相当やばそうじゃねえか。あれだったら救急車呼ぶか。いや、カズトリキ Graphic sensors. そこを通るものをこれでカウントするんだよ。
まだやるなんて一言も言ってねえぞそそそんな<笑>カウントしたくて仕方ないのに痛みのせいでできない哀れな私の前でそんなことを言うのかい頼むよ生かしたパーマくん、うん、痛みが増してきたパーマくん<笑>時給も高いよ At the end of the day, it's still just counting shit. What do I gotta do? I gotta pay attention. そいつは相当なベテランだな。<笑>まあね。カウントさせたら右に出る者はいない。ミスター交通量調査と同僚たちから呼ばれているよ。おっさん、そんなにすげえのか。<笑>今となっては、こんな手だけどね。でもよ、そんなにひどい検証縁になるってことは。交通量調査ってのは実はかなり力がいるのかいや力がいる仕事ではないよただこの辺は交通量が多くてねせわしなくカチカチしなくちゃならないんだよでも春日くんは見たところ私より丈夫そうだから体の心配はいらないと思うよへえじゃあとにかくひたすらカウントすればいいってことかああそうさこの数取り機をひたすら押す地道な作業が道路の計画や建設に役立つんだたまに座ってカチカチやってるやつらはそのための交通量調査員だったってわけだなそうともあれは車の種類やどんな人が通ったかをカウントしているんだよ調査員が集めたデータをいろんな機能が really、huh? どんどん発展していくんだへえ初めて知ったぜへえ初めて知ったぜへえ初めでは早速練習してもらおうと思うんだが準備はいいかねああいつでもいいぜ頼もしいねじゃあ練習を始めるよ初めはお手並み拝見ということで15秒カウントハメニメンパースウィフィンフィフティンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクンセクワン。あなたはクリッカー。ツー、トリー、フォー、なるほど。そうです、フォー。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。Ten thousand just for saying the number four. You gave me this much for clicking a little cookie thing? <laughs> Perks of the job. You didn't think. Actually, doesn't, isn't there like a counter in calculator? Man. Hold up. Oh, there's more to traffic sensors than this. I will get into the more advanced techniques next time. It's probably going to be keeping track of two things, which will render this thing a moot point. <laughs> oh, it's like an app. Screw that. <laughs> this easy, I wouldn't have gotten tendonitis. Regardless, harder work means harder pay, higher pay. I hope that entices you to stop by. Sure, I'll come by when I get some free time. Um, huh. Well, it's a shame my old overlay doesn't work anymore. Because I had a counter for that. Too lazy to set one on. Anyway. Ah, Kasaga kun, we meet again. Feel like helping you with traffic census? Sure. Oh. I'll give it another go. Thanks, Kasuga. I'll be a big help. Okay, then, let's try counting the number of women who pass by within a 20 second time frame. Alright, it's still one for one. Okay. It's probably gonna get harder. One. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Pretty good, nice accurate count. Getting the hang of this. Well then, here's your compensation. This is worth the money. My memory wasn't as sharp as yours when I was younger. I certainly had my share of supervisors yelling at me. Maybe, but 30 years later... And you're still here. That's right. I'm surprised you remembered that. 30 years, you, I've supported the city from behind the scenes, truthfully. I wasn't the best father, so... This job is my pride and joy. Pride and joy, hmm? Fitting for someone called the traffic sensor sensei. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> please. You're getting me all checked up. Kasuga-kun, you are indeed a fast learner, so come back soon, I'll teach you the rest. We're still not done? Haha, <laughs> isn't it exhilarating though? Your compensation will be even higher next time. Do stop by again. Yeah, yeah, I'll be back. I mean, this is probably, like, the loosest of all census gathering techniques. Ah, Kasuga again, blah 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 blah. Help out. Oh. Thanks, Kasuga again. That'd be a big help. Let's get into even more difficult counting. I'd like you to separately count the number of men. Wim- Oh, both. Okay. Crap. The streets are busier, so keep those eyes peeled. Okay. Dude. Oh, okay. I counted six and five. Mm. Damn it. Well, it'd be a lot easier if there wasn't so much shit passing by. What's the hell up with this road? I may have missed one. Yokohama has always been a lively and dapper little city. Anyhow, why don't we try again? Okay. I mean, I thought it was... Maybe it was five and six and not six and five. Oh. Okay. Seven and five. I think. Mm. No. Oh, man. I'm not good at this. In my defense, it is light. <laughs> oh. Alright, come on. Okay. I counted five men, six women. There we go. Thank you, Kasuga. Alright. I was probably off by one each time. なかなか面白いだろう<笑> カスガ君がいれば安心して引退できるな。何言ってんだよ、道野のおっさん。まだまだ元気だろ。それがね。私の腕はただの検証縁じゃないようなんだ。え、どういうことだよ。痛みと腫れだけじゃなくてね。痺
is severe RSI. Which is why stretching is important. <笑>そうだろ地味で地道な仕事なんだよ でも毎日こうやって活取り機を押すことで少しずつ景観が変わっていくのを見ると胸が熱くなるんだだからこれからは自分が楽しんだ分後継者にこの面白みを伝えられたらいいなと思ってるんだよじゃあ俺がその第一
It's kind of disappointing. ちょっと変わったと思わねえかんそうかうんそうだな。apparently つかどう見ても ガネは何も変わってねえっつってんだろ。調子いいみたい。はあ。あ、だ、サイフ。開けてみるか。痛ぜ。ああ。さあ、あの、it's oh. Hello. I remember thinking this last time I was here, but this office has tons of cats, huh? They're all strays, actually. We found them, abandoned, and weak. And because we kept taking them in, well, here we are. Treating animals with kindness is a hero's task, too. Look at how healthy they are now. Yeah, man. People who rescue animals are heroes, too. They look pretty grateful. I'd like to think so. I can't imagine life without cats now. If it means protecting them, I would even become an anti-hero. I hear anti-heroes are pretty popular now anyway. Haha. <laughs> Do I respond to this? You're welcome here anytime, so feel free to get your fill of the kitties. Oh, thanks. <laughs> really? I mean, you can't pet them. Just chillin'. Hmm, okay. I guess this is just the headquarters for part-time hero. It's weird because it looked like there was a mission here. What is this? Hello? Is this Kasuga san? Yeah, what's up? It's the cats! You have to help me find <laughs> Huh? The cats from your office? Yes, I'm afraid so. They escaped through the broken office door whilst I was on the phone with a vendor. I'm worried sick about them. I'd go look for them myself, but I have to stay here in case they find their way back to the office. That's where you come in, Kasuga-san. This is my official request to you. To find my cats. You'll be generously compensated, so please. Please find them. If it's an official request, what choice do I have? I'll gather them up and get them back to your office. Thank you, Kasuga-san. There are nine cats in total. Should be easy enough. Yeah, nine cats in a whole city. Unless it's within a radius. I love how the moment I opened the door, the phone call came in. Just Not even 30 seconds ago, I was there. Does it mark it? Uh, it might. Hang on. Yeah, nine cats with no specific details, actually, that's a fair point. Not a collar, not even a name to call them by.
they're probably guarding them. Ugh. Okay, what's the fight worth fighting? It'd be funny if you do learn the move that's like the uh I probably can't make the noise because the mic won't pick it up, but the noise you make to call cats. That's how you use a bat. Missed. I thought it would get that guy on the left. <laughs> Just love the cards. Someone got run over by a car in battle. Okay, that was an achievement. That really didn't get me much XP. Um... thing hold on there's a food thing here Ugh, i knew that was gonna happen but i'm kind of desperate to get food i mean why put that there um yeah apparently whoops i'm destroying this sign Okay. Yeah, I mean, health was a little dire. Alright, so this isn't the cat thing. Are you sure you want to attack me? There's a part-time hero on the way, and I bet he won't be too happy about this. That must be my client. Alright. Oh, okay. Oh, that only did six. Man, there is like a very big discrepancy of how much damage they're doing. Uh, he's doing the the counter stance. I don't really have a choice. Okay. 
Man, you really came through for me there. You're getting a five-star review for sure, plus a nice comment, and I'm posting this up on Chatter. Go to show your hero's love, right? Okay. Is this, is this being for real, that I have to search an entire city? For cats? I'm going to the park. <laughs> there's any spot that there's likely to be one. Find nine cats. Like, I, I can't believe it. Oh, there are batting cages here too. Okay. Yeah, but... I'm not doing that minigame because I've done it in previous games. Oh! There's one. Pretty sure someone on part time here asked me to find a cat. Found your little feline butt. You know, you shouldn't really worry your own like that. Too bad you don't speak human. Great work. Let's go give Hero Sun some peace of mind. Hero Sun was busy, so I came in his stead. Thanks for finding this one. Leave the rest to me. Oh, okay. So let me get this straight. He has an assistant to come pick up the cat, but not an assistant to go look for the cat. I guess that's me. Doesn't have a team to go look for the cats. I hope it's something where they just randomly spawn. And it's not that they're in specific places around the city, because that would, uh... Definitely suck. Yeah, that's a nightmare scenario, but there's always quests like this in games. Needle in a haystack. Uh, I'm okay. No, I'm not. I suppose I should be fighting them. I need to grind XP.
still think the park is like the best bet. Wait, where am I going? Okay, this is fine. I just didn't recognize where I was. Wait, there's a van here too? I didn't know that. Oh. <laughs> See, if I would have known, I probably would have come for some of this stuff earlier. What do you sell? Food. Um, probably a good idea to buy this stuff. Just so I'm restocked. Yeah. This is a normal normal store. I'm running through here because Adachi required bugs for his next armor or, or weapon. I can't remember. Flowers. I'm good. There's probably an advantage to planting those. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> this is starting to feel like the cats are going to be in very specific spots. It doesn't look like they're marked. Because what, the one that I found was there and I did not see an indicator on the map. This is a needle in a haystack scenario. Maybe it is random. Pretty sure someone on part time here at us need to find a cat. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I don't know how to test this, like, to figure out if it's for real. Wait, what is going on over there? There's someone staring at a tree. Why? Oh, okay. Let's get rid of you. I mean, that's the good thing about the real estate mode was just learning those moves. That was weird. They are on their own.
結構歩いたなどっかで休むかそうね<笑> okay. Just call it. どうしたんだいナンバーさっきからおとなしいなあいやちょっとお腹の調子が悪くてな常温で保存してた牛乳が傷んでやがったかでも少し良くなってきたぜそそうかあんまあ、oh, I interrupted them I'm an idiot I kind of that's a little bit of a an oversight that you can't just go about your business all right what's the next part-time hero thing besides from that one I need to get toilet paper I mean maybe I should probably pop into a convenience store and resolve that one Okay, let him finish. Low pause. Nihongo that will Nikuman this name. So, so. Onotomo Kaigui Surno this name. The Tekiri Zembu Tskutte Irunokato. Pause de Keko Tskur no Taihin de Sa. Cut the Hoga Hayayon, eh? So you monodesco. Okay. Apparently this is one. <laughs> oh man. These designs. I don't know if that was good. Oh, this is a pickpocket. Now we need to get rid of him. Oh, no. Damn it. Okay, didn't steal money. Good. I was thinking the dude was going to steal. I guess going on a shopping spree in a heavy populated area comes with own risk. If I run into any more trouble, I'll ask for you again. Alright. Yeah, I wanted to go shopping, but... Yeah, there's another one there. Alright. I guess the lesson here is... Unlike the other games... Um, definitely doing the side content and these missions seem to be important. To make sure you stay... Leveled. Nice, got two of them. Oh, he moved. Oh, that got him. It got him. Nice. Should probably be enough, right? Eh, not quite. Okay. 
I thought my special feature on Chinatown was about to go down the drain. Thank you so much. Hello. Where is it? I heard it. I heard the meow. Where's the meow? <laughs> I mean, a third of the way. I got the feeling it's random. I don't know. But okay. Ooh. I want to go that way. I may as well. It's heels, so why not? おちゃんとおのみちおくんのグッズ売ってるね。おのみちおくん？おのみちのゆるキャラだよ。頭が発作のね。That's <laughs> one of the best new costs. スタッフの手伝いとかしたんだぜ。なんだよ、手伝いって。パチモングッズ売ってるやつと殴り合いよ。バシッと成敗してやったぜ。お前らしい手伝い方だな。黄色い着ぐるみ着て殴り合いって何番もやってみたらどうだ案外似合いそうだ着ねえよ黄色い着ぐるみなんてそんなもん着て殴られたんじゃたまんねえからなまあそれもそうだな隊長万全だぜいら
I mean, we're getting tough content, so it'll help. Alright, leave that dude stunned. Focus on this guy. I feel like the, the cost of Pigeon Storm isn't worth what it does. I don't know. Like, it costs so much more, but it doesn't seem to do as much damage. Maybe I'm imagining it. Alright, let's just see. I'll use it this time. How much is this gonna do? Okay, so that's that much. Let's keep going. Okay, now Pigeon Raid. Yeah, look at that. What does it do? Unless it does a chance to... ...do something else, but it, it seems to... Given the cost difference... That doesn't seem to be worth it. Like, I could get several uses out of the base one. Yeah, so hang on. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, the base one seems better. The diff it, it doesn't seem like that big of a difference between the two in terms of damage. And the cost is like more than double. I guess going on an eating spree in a heavily populated area. Oh, it's like another heavy populated area. Hello. Don't know where to look. This guy's looking for Ruby. If I can find him. Have this. Take care of you. Oh, you should. Thank you so much. I'm awfully thrilled. Oh, you must let me thank you somehow. Alright, want to help my company? You can work under you? Very well, I'll do it. I don't run this store just for sure, but I'll make sure I'll make myself useful. My name is Hal. It's a pleasure. Okay. Excuse me, but what exactly are you doing here? <laughs> mm, oh, you're pretty stylish, and you seem like you can keep a secret. Congratulations, you pass. I did? Really? Yep, go to the stall in the back. There's a hidden door inside. A hidden door to where? Why don't you find out yourself? Enjoy your time, Mr. Handsome. Thanks. Apparently there's something nice beyond the door in the back. I'm curious, might as well check it out. I'm gonna get mugged, aren't I? Uh... Oh, this is a mugging. Oh, it's gambling. Never mind. Yeah, but like... I mean, at least it's stuff that I could probably make money off, but... Money's not my problem at the moment. Alright, I'm leaving. Very elaborate. I love how the security guy's just gone now. I'm 
I'll go here. Look for toilet paper. I mean, I do have items that make gambling odds better. But, again, I don't need money. And I feel like it'd be time better spent in the, uh, the real estate mode. Oh, I completely forgot about the school as well. え、何か俺にも取れそうなものあるかな。資格って何も持ってないんだよね。調理師とかどうだい。料理うまいし。うーん。なんかもっとこう、しっくりくるようなのがいいな。暗殺検定とかない。それなら私も取りたいですね。小
Need more cash, go to convenience store and we'll throw some cash. It's that easy. I don't believe it. I have none. Oh, wait. I have 10 grand in my ATM. Since when? Anyway, toilet paper? Apparently not. I'm getting emergency supplies. They don't sell toilet paper. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do for that guy. I take it cast against on. Hero son said to look out for you. Well, he's probably completed delivery. Oh, there we go. Interesting. I don't remember doing those, but okay. I think I'm gonna have to go battle tower. Pro probably not today. I don't know, man. Ten levels is a lot. At least if that threat is to be believed, which I do believe it, like that was rough, that fight. Like I stood no chance against it. Yeah, I mean, I, I just have to fight everything. It's just no... Okay, there's a level 41. There's a level 40 enemy there. I don't get how that works. Somehow, I guess one of them's tankier, but it, it's weird. And then that wasn't worth much experience. There just seems to be enemies that can be low level and tanky. And then enemies that are high level but not as tanky. And then enemies that just are, are weird in between. I'm not bothering. I think, honestly, the battle tower is probably the way to go. Like, I seem to get levels really consistently with that. Where I heard it. Am I blind? Still hear it. 
sneaky. How many is that? Four? <laughs> Still. A lot. This had better be a worthy reward. You know? Fine, I'll apologize if you want. When's that hero gonna get here? Alright. Oh, this is like a waste of time. And yet, look at that! Level 18, and look at how little damage. It just makes no sense. Done virtually no experience for it. It wasn't so invested in this finding the cats thing. Wait, apparently there's a contract here. I probably wouldn't bother. I mean, the good news is it's giving me crafting materials, so, like, that is a positive. And then she wants shots level 29s. Like, it makes no sense. That was worth less experience than the previous fight, despite the enemies being higher level by, like, almost double. Yeah, I don't get this. This park used to have all sorts of playground equipment, but apparently got all removed to safety concern. Now there's nothing left. Yeah. The playground equipment that was at my my first school got removed as well for that same reason. I mean, they swapped it to something else, but safety concerns. Recruit. Sure. I mean, more potential staff members for the final stretch, why not? Open as the food soul. Dude, the radius that they can pick a fight with me is, is just insane. to be sure. Do I hear a cat? Oh, yeah. There. That was a different sound. Five? There's like four left.
You're Kasuga san, right? I heard about you from Hero san. Feel free to report back once you've finished a deliver. Oh. Yeah, nothing. Never mind. Alright, this way. What's going on, Will? I thought you were going to progress the game tonight. Oh, I had to go on a hunt for cats around the city. Because I'm too on the level to go fight Majima. Huh? I haven't even leveled up. <laughs> this is horrible. I'm going to have to definitely do Battle Tower next time. I knew it was going to be difficult, but damn. That was a hell of a, a like, uh, a level check. Choice to go. Right in the middle. nearby. It could be above or... It's most likely above. There you are. I'm getting there. This is definitely not random. Like, they got spread across the city and you have to basically run around the whole city. Which, if I didn't have the part-time hero thing as well, this would be... It's over, Kasuka. I have the high ground. Yeah, Storm's not so worth. Um, actually, let me walk through this alley just in case. Oh. Hey. What gives? There we go. 
Yeah, that's a very basic item. I didn't expect anything great out of it. I don't know if that'll get everyone. That did. Just check this car park real quick. Okay. Just checking. Oh, and if I can't be the boss, I at least want to smell like him. I wish I had some twist fragrance. Hand over the brand name goods. Okay, I don't have that. Good. No, avoid one fight and run into another one. Whoops. Wrong target. Yeah, that was a waste. Oh, okay. I guess the other thing as well is the whole Sujimon thing, like, I guess I'm inadvertently doing that too. Is this... is this anything? No. Okay. Ugh, I have no choice. Just take him out quick. Good. The dodgy slam! Oh, wait. Let him finish that talk. ここで働けばお金もらえて一石二鳥じゃねえか。一石二鳥？お金稼ぐのともう一つを？え、それはその社会貢献？どうせならもっとうまいこと言えよ。冗談よ。でもこのバイトは賞見られないわ。え、そこの担当者と知り合いなんだけど、バイトはモギリや機材調整係だって。ああ、そうなんだ。それに下心で門を叩く人はすぐにわかるってさ。え、違うぞ。俺は真面目に
and this one's not. Like, <laughs> this one's tanky, despite me almost being twice their level. Like, I don't get this. It's so weird. There's another one right here. Uh, no, I'm fine. No, I'm not, because, yep, they can engage fights from that far away. <laughs> Excuse me, cannoli. I didn't. I saw the word cannoli. Oh, okay. <laughs> An updated version of this enemy. All right, none but go hard. Moist your time. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay, we're good. He's he's infatuated. Just do a normal stack slap. At this point, I'm, like, invested in finding all the cats. Like, I've, I've found... most of them. If I could be reborn as a hot stud, you know what I'd do? I'd waltz into this club right now and get all the ladies. Oops. That guy was the worst. All ugly and dirty. What even was that? I just want to go home and be with all my cute stuffed animal friends. What I wouldn't give to complete my kitty cat collection. I have to go to Club Sega to do that. If only I could be reborn as a sexy lady. Not do I get a job at this club right here. <laughs> Those two should, uh, meet up. What is this building? Apparently there's an entry to it. Oh, this is, um, yep. No, no, I know what it is. That's the soap land. Sure. 
crit. Okay. That was gold stolen. Hey Loki, what's up? I guess if people are waking up, that means it's late for me. Hey, there we go. I don't know how many cats I have left to find. I'm gonna guess three. What? This makes no sense! They're only level... They're only level 20. Alright. There we go. Yeah, this whole stream got derailed. <laughs> I was supposed to progress the story. And then, well, game was like, get good. So I have to make up, like, basically ten levels of experience. And now I'm hunting cats because I, I can't find a better way to do it. I need to go restore mana. Okay, they're, they're weak to fire, so just Nanba's got this. I mean, even still, man. I, I don't know. I think the, the, the enemies are sometimes just really weird. In the sense that... You would think a move that's super effective, where I'm like, effectively almost double his level. Okay, maybe like 1.5 with Nanba, but still. In Pokemon, using a super effective move, even five levels ahead, that's almost a one-shot. If not a one-shot. I'll use the lower tier one. And then there's this. It's like... It seems like the lower tier spells do a comparable amount of damage. To the point where, like... It's, with the exception of Kasuga's stuff. To the point where, like... It's not worth using the high tier version. Because it doesn't seem to do... That much more damage for the cost. It's a little weirdly balanced. Okay, um, where haven't I checked for these cats? Probably here. Oh, ]こういう店ならパンチパーマもできるかもしれねえな。パンチパーマなんてしたいの? Ooh. Stop! Look, look at the map. Look at the map right now. Look at this. <laughs> What's a punch perm? I have no idea. You know, I only heard, I've only heard the term perm. Um, in movies and stuff. So I don't think I've... I mean, maybe they were a thing here, but I'm not sure. It's definitely before my time, because that's like... 80s and maybe early 90s, where I was too young. All I know is this dude looks like um, Eric Andre from the back. Yeah, I mean, I know what it is, I just don't... I'm not sure what a punch perm is, exactly. Or I suppose I know the end result. I'm not sure what the process actually is. You know this tall sounds like... Oh yeah, that's like... Fine, it's another tall dude. Like, I'm not sure exactly what happens. Based on the pictures, it's a much tighter bunch of curls. Interesting. 
Yeah, maybe people have done it here. I don't know. Not the sort of thing I paid attention to. Okay, I can't be bothered. I'm spending the money. Let's go, Team America. You probably won't take him out. Yep. Okay, one only, but still, they're stunned, so that's good. The, th the haircut that has made a comeback here, which I'm surprised to see, is like the mullet. The mullet has made a comeback in Australia amongst, I guess, yeah, like Gen Z in particular. I don't know why. You've never played any of the Yakuza series, but based on this, you should play them. So this one's different. The other ones are more like action where you're actually fighting in real time. This one is different because the main character has changed. And so this guy's whole thing is he loved Dragon Quest as a kid. So now as an adult, whenever he fights, um, he just imagines he's in an RPG. So that's the whole angle to this is like, when you're into combat, it's his imagination. Which is a pretty clever way to, like, just make the game insane in terms of just what happens, you know? The others, don't get me wrong, they're, they're weird. But this one it cranked that up a notch with the system. For example... You've seen plenty of models in Ohio. No kidding. Yeah. It's a Saints Row but Japanese. I haven't played Saints Row. But if Saints Row, let's say, involves walking into a building and then accidentally walking into a group of Japanese businessmen that like to dress up in diapers and um, get fed milk by a lady. And then you have to beat the ever-living shit out of them. Then yes. <laughs> Just to name one thing. Why is this dude so... T I don't understand why this guy's so tanky. Sans for number one starts off with gang warfare taking over the city by the end of the series. You're literally fighting in hell. <laughs> I may have to try this. Uh, the only reason I've kind of been... And I don't know, this, this might be like... Not keeping an open mind, but... I don't know what it is about Ubisoft stuff, with the exception of a couple things. Generally speaking, I get bored of Ubisoft games, like, by the end of it, it's just, like, repetitive. Like, whatever novelty they had at the start, it's kind of, like, it just wears thin. I don't know. That might be a bit of a hot take, but just my experience I've had with those games. And I also hate the Ubisoft launcher, like, no. Saints Row is Ubisoft, right? Yeah. 
It'd be funny if it wasn't, then I'm like, oh man, I've got this totally wrong. Notable weapons include a pimp cane shotgun. And a double-ended adult-ended novelty toy. Okay, hang on. It's... Oh, it's Deep Silver. Yeah, I got it wrong then. I thought it was Ubisoft for some reason. I might be thinking of something else. Yeah, maybe I need to give it a try. Um... Okay. Nimmu Kandu! I present to you the health device upsized for more medically effective vibrations. One of the earliest. I had this weapon for quite some time, so it's too weak now, but yeah. I think uh, it's in good company. <laughs> I need eight. I mean, in game, like, they don't have MP. Said so novelty device wobbles as you beat people with it. That's fantastic. Ah, uh, the two fast spread out. This dude's level 40, and look at how... I mean, I guess an assassin character. I don't know, this decision consistency is, like, bothering me a little. Good follow up. Anyway, should definitely try the series as well because it's at a point now where every entry is available on modern hardware. You know, it's either been remastered or remade. What the hell? What what are we attacking here? Oh, someone's invisible. What? What do I do? Okay, cause stealth. There we go. That's interesting. That's a first. I've still got two more games after this one. I mean, the remakes are really good and exceptional quality, so they're worth getting over the originals, which is usually not something I say. Just because um, the quality of life that they've done to it is, is better. I have physical copies of these games, so it's fine. But I mean, otherwise, what, you're like looking at PS2, PS2 at the earliest, I think. I have not found any more cats. I 
I may have to give up. It may have started on PS3. I'm not sure. Using it in here. These cats will be found. PS2 has given you the most headaches to be able to play games, especially the old fat style system. In what way? Like, them breaking down, or more of a... because their output, um... They don't do, like, a HDMI. Unless you mod it. Them breaking down. Yeah, I can't really say. I have a PS2 Slim and it's fine. Well, I got a pretty cheap second hand. Came off a stack of games, and though there were some garbage ones in the pile, um, I got some good ones like San Andreas, um, FF10. What else? There's like a few others, but those two alone kind of justified it a bit. Oh, and a few other Crash Bandicoot games, which I haven't actually played them. Hey, Gami. Wait, the PS2 existed in a transitionary period for games. There's three different types of discs on the market. Each one requires a different depth to read for lasers. The original launch system relied on some motors that burn out easy. That makes sense. I mean, that's generally the thing with older consoles is, like, they had silent revisions, right? Where they'd swap out a part or two. Like, I know the Super Nintendo, for example. Um, some of the later ones have a better PPU. Slightly better. So when you're using the actual signal, it comes out cleaner. The ones that uh, were, like, later on in life, closer to the N64's release. So one of the, the one I have from childhood is, like, one of those later ones. That are usually sought after. Because it fixed the plastic yellowing, like it doesn't yellow. And when you're, you know, using a cable to hook it into an upscaler, it comes out cleaner. I imagine the PS2 had a bunch of stuff like that. They'd probably change just internals that didn't really matter on paper. But then ultimately end up mattering in terms of, you know, people getting the consoles as a collector's thing. I mean, turn a CRTV for old school games to avoid problems with upscaling. I mean, I've never had a CRT, but I will say, like, the retro tink, though expensive, man, that thing is really good at upscaling. It's kind of impressive. And just the fact that you can do, um... 
CRT stuff because it's 4K. Like, you can make it mimic a CRT and then... Because it um, does HDR, it means you can do that stuff without sacrificing the image. Like, it doesn't become darker. Oh, okay. What is this? This dude's level 41. What is going- what is going on? I'm only doing one damage, what- I guess the thing with CRTs is like, inevitably, unless a company comes out and starts manufacturing them again, both the parts and the skill set to kind of maintain them is just- Gonna become rarer and rarer. I, I don't know what's happening with this fight. You see, using the racer to hold down the game in the NES console to get it to work sometimes. Oh, yeah. I think that happened to ours. All you have to do is just kind of open it up and just lift up the pins because the design of it, like, ultimately that happens to all of them. The pins get pushed down. It's a pretty easy fix, but it's kind of, yeah. Okay. That was such a weird fight. You know what's fun? You know what I thought I thought about recently is like, and it didn't really um, it didn't really occur to me. But there was a time period where like cartridges were called cassettes because of the NES. I d vaguely remember it, but it it's a thing because on the back of some of the Super Nintendo ones, it's it still says sup uh. Nintendo cassette. Which is just like, I don't remember ever calling it a cassette, but it was definitely a thing. It was just because of the NES worked like a VHS, that's why. It looked like a VHS, so they were called cassettes for a while. It was a game cassette. But I don't remember, like, I remember just calling it cartridges, but that can't be the case, because almost all the branding calls them cassettes. It's kind of crazy to think about. Like, I got a Super Nintendo cart in front of me, and it says Super Nintendo Game Cassette <laughs> on the back. <laughs> Kids like to put more force than needed into the cartridges. Yeah. No, that's definitely true. Right, I'm gonna do some bonding. I'm gonna listen to some cutscenes for a while. Because it's important so then their bond level rises and we can do more combat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You've only ever heard of cartridges being called cartridges. You need to look into this. Seriously. I have um one from Japan. Super Famicom cassette on the back. なるほど。その辺はさすがに半品流マンの元総帥か。俺の場合は生まれながらのね。そこらの人とはちょっと苦労してるとこが違う。ギャングの跡取り息子のうちね。<laughs> 
Maybe it was like a regional thing. But I do remember them being called cassettes in Australia. I'm gonna find an English one. While they're talking. ハンピン龍馬の先代だったっけ今はどうしてんだい引退してから何年かして死んだよ誰かに撃たれたり刺されもせずベッドの上でそいつは良かったってことになるのかなギャングのボスだった割にはね四六時中誰かに襲われないか
the ca one of my hard drives when it was plugged in as it was booting, it would cause the blue screen. So I changed the cable on the hard drive. This is like several hours of me like freaking out. Because, um, you know, I built with an Intel processor, and right now there's a drama going on with Intel processors. But anyway, I tested for the Intel processor stuff, like the problems, and it's not exhibiting that. But it's still doing weird things. And it's ever since I installed a patch that's supposed to deal with the processor, like, potentially breaking... So, I don't know. If that if it's too technical, basically I'm crapping myself that my, it's either my processor or like I need to change some setting. It seems to happen when the computer comes out of sleep. But now today, like, the browser seems to be crashing randomly, like, the page, and I'm not sure why. So, I need to look into stuff. It's a, lo it's a long story, but, yeah. OBS crashed earlier as well. Ugh. Oh, hey, sir. Thanks for the, uh, 44 months, dude. Really appreciate that. Good thing I know about computers, because you'd be completely lost. I mean, a lot of us just, it's looking and thinking and ruling things out. It's basic troubleshooting, but it's not like I know exactly what's going on. Like, the Intel thing has been on the news. Like, I caught wind of it, and then, yeah, uh, I've been keeping an eye on it. Um... As for what's currently wrong, I'm not sure, but at least it's not at the point where it was like a few days back where I, it, the computer was completely unusable. And I was worried I'd have to haul the whole damn thing back to where I got it from, which is a pain because it's big. I was, things, I was just finishing talking about like my computer's been having issues this week, so it's been a little daunting. I don't think there's anything wrong with that, I think that's something really simple. The big paranoia I have is because currently there's a problem with Intel processors where, like, they're dying, basically. Just gotta go get a line of what could go wrong based on probability. Well, one of my friends said to check the memory, and that's probably a good idea, because when I mentioned that it seems to happen when it comes out of sleep mode, it's like the RAM conf config could be like a problem. So I'm probably going to mess with that tomorrow. Um, disable like any, any sort of fancy acceleration the motherboard has. And just set it to stock. But the thing that I've been testing the most to see is like if it crashes the CPU. Like that's the biggest thing because right now, um, any Intel processor from the last two years is has the potential of basically dying unless you upgrade the BIOS before it starts exhibiting stuff, which. I ran stress tests, and, um, it was fine. Like, it wasn't... Eliminate hardware issues before messing with software. Well, the RAM config is, like, hardware. I'd have to go into the BIOS and just change it. Well... <laughs> But, you know, initially when I was getting the blue screens, it was after a Windows update, so I thought Windows update bricked the machine, basically. And it was a fair enough assumption, because system restore wasn't working. But then, yeah, I did a clean install of Windows, and it's just kept doing it after sleep. 
Which the ram seems like it's going to be the most likely thing. And if it's a problem with the ram, though it sucks, at least that's easy to diagnose. Because I can just remove the sticks and take the sticks back. I don't have to take the whole damn thing. But, um, I've been reading that, yeah. Sometimes motherboards try to overclock RAM in a smart way, and often that can cause crashes. So, I'm gonna try. Maybe the BIOS update, like, reset the motherboard settings and enabled that or some shit. Is the RAM seated pro properly? Are they clean? Um, I haven't touched it, so I would assume so. Like, this has only started popping recently, but I should probably try and push them in. They're definitely clean, because, like, I, I dust and keep them pristine. The computer's not old. It's only a few months old. And yeah, the install is very clean, like, there's just a cool, the cooling, um, just slightly over it, but not enough to touch, like, it's not even close to touching it, so. It's a very clean install of cabling and everything. It could also be the GPU, but I don't know. If it was the GPU, I feel like I'd be seeing bad things in games, you know? Like, I, I haven't ruled out the CPU yet. Sorry for the 20 questions. Oh, no, no, it's good. It's all good, man. Like, I appreciate it. Nobody likes a computer that's not working, and you know, sometimes talking it out, you might come to an aha moment. Um, the other, the other option is like just disabling, not letting the computer sleep. If like the problem is stemming from letting the computer go into sleep mode, I just simply don't let it do that. <laughs> just. Turn it off. I need to get into a better habit of turning the computer off. But the, the time it usually goes to sleep is like, you know, I'll end the stream, I'll leave the VODs uploading, and then the computer will go to sleep. And I wake up and, you know, if I need to use it, I turn it on, otherwise I turn it off. Who needs sleep? <laughs> It's kind of funny. It's like I have a com I have a computer that's an insomniac, doesn't like to sleep. Been told hard shutdowns are best for PCs. Yeah, I'm kind of starting to realize that now. But that's the irony, is like. I hard shut down the computer and didn't use it for a few days, and then when I came back, it was like BSOD loop. Anyway, sorry to derail like Nanba's conversation here. I have been following it, but. That's been my life the past half week or so. And also just as a, you know, when you rent here, real estate agents do an inspection every now and then, every few months. Three to six months, so I, I got one next week, so I've been cleaning as well on top of trying to make sure that I don't need to take this computer in for an RMA. <sighs> But on the bright side, you know, I got an ROG Ally X, and that's been working beautifully. I've been playing games on the couch and in bed. 
It's nice to be able to do that instead of sitting at a desk. Because I, I just sit at my desk too much. Um, but you know, that illustrates Valve should have really released the Steam Deck in Australia. It would have done really well. Because this thing has sold pretty well in Australia. You're glad you got a house and don't need to worry about inspections. Screw that noise. Yeah, it's 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 annoying for sure. It depends on the real estate agent as well. Like some of them, they're very pedantic, and then others are a bit more chill. The ones I got now, they're a lot better. Um, at least in Australia, there's regulation. Like, they have to give you a, a minimum amount of time as a heads up. You've been playing Mario Kart and Animal Crossing the past week and missing your Sims game. <laughs> At least those are fine. I've been checking out this, um, new game that's... It's in early access. But it's like a game in the same realm as Stardew Valley. But it's really good. Oh, she's definitely drunk. It's, it's like called Field of, Fields of Mysteria. And it is very good. What's it played on? Currently PC only, because, um, it's in early access, but I'm sure it's coming to everything else. If there's an unexpected person wanting access to your home, you have the castle doctrine to fall back on. Fair. You hear that can't suddenly be like, hey, we're coming tomorrow. Unless it's like something really, really justified that's an emergency. Alright. I'm sorry this is like very cutscene heavy, but the context here is tonight I wanted to progress the story, and what ended up happening is I progressed the story and then the fight that I needed to do absolutely destroyed me and you know. Apparently I'm ten ten levels underleveled for that that fight somehow. What's been going on in the game? Um so we're at the point where the Koreans burnt down the, the money pr printing factory. And then um, he met with the guy that's like a politician that's that was originally the young master, the guy in the wheelchair. And he, the guy's basically, yeah, just snapped. Like, that night, uh, after, you know, he was in the bathroom where he heard the girl not really liking him. He, uh, walked out of the club, the drugs wore off, and people were, like, making fun of him, so... It ended with him being in an alley, and then... Some random Yakuza dude picked a fight with him, he didn't know who he was, and then... Out of anger, he shot him in the face, and basically that's the reason why Ichiban had to go to jail. Um, but, you know, it's been implied that the old man, um, he shot Kasuga on purpose and put the fake note in his pocket so then he could connect with the Yakuza here in this town. But there's, it's, there's, it's not much clearer on that other than that. So we're heading to, I was heading to their headquarters to kind of confront and find out, okay, did he really save Kasuga? And then, um, Kiryu's friends turned up, and those are who I lost to. <laughs> so, and now it's a question of, well, why are they there? Like, that's enemy territory, why are they there? And I got my ass kicked, and then I started looking for nine stray cats around the city for the last two hours, so, here we are. 
実はもうすでに50万貸してたみたいなのにもう200万貸せって言われてるの合わせて250ゆとりができたからって菜の葉はまだこの先も入りようなんだぜそれは桂川も分かってるでもあいつはどこからか菜の葉が乙姫ランドにいたと聞きつけた Did I find the cats? I think I've found five or six out of the nine. But it is very much like you have to crawl the entire city to find them. Yeah, so I was just looking at what my friend recommended. It's like, um, XMP profiles on the motherboard will run, uh, RAM at like a higher clock speed or timing, and that may cause the computer to crash. Which is like, then why use it? I guess it's like to pull performance out of it, but I'm not doing anything that. Uh, maybe the video. No, but the video would be GPU based. I don't know. But I might try it because it's kind of gotten pretty bad, and if it's just disabling that performance mode, I, I don't care. I'd rather a stable computer. Plus, it can't be good if that's causing it. あきらめるなよ。さっちゃんは菜の葉が憎くて桂川と引き離すわけじゃないんだ。菜の葉の人生を思ってこそ。だろ。そりゃもちろんよ。その思いは必ず菜の葉に伝わる。でも私伝え方
just unreasonably angry. It was six screens and I was like, please, just, I just need, I just need this computer on for five minutes and then it's going back off. Please just stop. Hey there, we noticed you're not using Microsoft Edge as your default browser and Bing as your default search engine. Would you like to change your preferences? We noticed you're not using OneDrive. Did you know you can get OneDrive with 10 gigabytes of storage? Your copy of Windows comes with a 1 gigabyte trial. Do you know what the worst part about it now is they've changed it? Like now some of the options say, ask me again in three days if you don't want to do it. It's like, I don't want you to ask me again ever. Like, stop it. If I'm not, if I decided not to use Office at that point in time, like you reminding me about it every three months is not going to change my mind about Office. Or OneDrive. Again, the best word to describe Windows 11 is just it's adversarial. They should have an option to never show this message again. Uh, it just shouldn't... I mean... It should just be like, if I am actively changing my browser and installing a new browser and setting that default browser, then clearly I don't want to use your browser. Do you know what I mean? It's like it shouldn't get to that point where it's presenting a screen. Well, I guess it's like, if I needed Microsoft Office, I'd get it. Imagine, and this is like a very insane kind of straw man example. But just <laughs> imagine you get a bicycle that comes with like some kind of lock on it, right? And every time you unlock it, the bike is like, Hey, we noticed you don't have a car. Would you like to upgrade to a car? It's like, dude, if I wanted a car, I would go and get the car. I wouldn't have the bicycle. That's how it feels sometimes. Just like, dude, if I wanted office, I would have got an office to begin with. But like you don't know what you're missing out on. Well, that's the thing. It's like, well, what what if I'm a person that never needs to edit Word documents? As insane as that sounds, I'm in a position where I don't touch PowerPoint presentations, Word documents, because they're done in different software where I work. We don't use Word. We don't use PowerPoint. We don't use Excel. Like, there's other stuff that does that. And now they've even started asking about Game Pass now. It never used to do Game Pass, now it does Game Pass. It's like, hey, would you like three months on Game Pass? It's like, what if, what if the person is not a gamer? Like, are you really going to ask him about Game Pass? What if they have a bad enough internet connection that they don't download games? Like, that is still a possibility. 
資産家から援助を受けている話をしたら長谷川さんから詐欺話を持ちかけられて本当にごめんなさい<笑>ああ山田さんいや足立刑事ななんでそのことを oh, you know it's, it's 気づいていました僕のことをここまで気にかけてくれる人は足立さん以外考えられないと I mean, you probably should have told him sooner. This probably makes him feel better, though. That was the thing that was eating him up. Hey, pass the test. No more paying. I mean, everyone in this crew kind of has a good heart. So, 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 いや、しかし、よかったな、足立さん。高橋君、ちゃんとお前の金がもしなかったとしても、あいつはきっと自分の力で夢を叶えていたさ。そういうやつなんだよ。きっといい弁護士になって、たくさんの人を救ってくれるさ。な、そうだな。いろいろありがとうよ、カズが。なんだ
I've also been hit by a car every stream, practically. <laughs> the exception of that one, where everything was good. This is, but the problem I'm having is I need to level up, but these dudes aren't giving much level, so I think I'm gonna go to this battle tower thing. <laughs> what are these enemies? I mean, if we get to Adachi's turn, we get to see his new move. Eh, maybe. Like, if it's as cool as this move, I'll be happy. The problem is Adachi is too slow to attack. By the time he attacks, it's over. Yeah, smack that bench. Do we have jury duty in Australia? I think we do, but I've never been called. You've just been summoned, oh really? I mean, you can get excused, like, you can say that you have a child that requires care, and you'd be telling the truth. I think here, if you summon, you have to go, otherwise you get fined. You just have to get from a note from a doctor. Yeah, then... Easy. It's definitely annoying. But it's just one of those things that just pops up by surprise. They don't even pay enough, they pay? It's $40 a day, oh. <laughs> Basically they give you enough for like, a meal and then any sort of um... Public transit you needed to take to get there. I bet that's how they figure it out. It's like, okay, how much would a meal cost? And if they were taking any sort of transit, what would it cost them? It's pretty much just to cover you getting there and eating. I'm curious now if while these cars passed. Oh. Hold on.
Apparently here you need to your name needs to be on the jury roll. Interesting. Oh, I see. Jury roll is like... Okay. That makes sense. It's it's like... It comes part of your citizenship, which I guess, yeah, that means I would be on it. I can't... I can't believe I'd let this quest do this to me. Like, I'm looking... I'm looking for cats. <laughs> oh. It's actually a thing. I don't have... I imagine these come with winning the real estate mode, which I'm almost... I've, I've had to play the real estate mode because I needed money, and that was the best way to do it. Ah, oh, I interrupted. It's fine. It's not paying your bills. If you're going to pay what you make in a day, it wouldn't be bad. Would love to do it, but can't afford it. Yeah. Forty dollars a day. That's kind of wacky. Would you like to know how much it is in Australia? Actually, it's kind of comparable. It's like $69.50 if it's four hours or less. But then it, for more than four hours, it's $139. So the moment you cap after four hours, you get $139. That's for a first day, and then on the second day it gets to 139 per day. If it goes any further than that, 152, then 168. If it's like after 10 days. I mean, that's Australian dollars, keep that in mind. It's, it's like, it starts off roughly the same as what it is for you. But then, that's for four hours. Basically, for four hours, you get about 40 bucks, maybe a little more. And then the moment it's more than, than that, it doubles, effectively. It's good to know. I knew it was a thing in Australia, I just I never looked into it because I guess I haven't been summoned, knocking on wood. <laughs> I mean, the other thing, the other way to look at it is like, it's not work either. You've gotten called twice, damn. I suppose it depends as well, like, on your district. Like, if there's... I guess if there's a lot of... cases, then that might be why. See, I live in the city, so you would think, like, the odds would be higher. It's like every seven to ten years. I guess I've been lucky. I don't know if my dad's been ever called to it. I should ask. Yeah, 
どうしたんだいナンバーさっきからおとなしいなあいやちょっとお腹の調子が悪くてな I, I might need to give up on this hunt でも少し良くなってきたぜそ,そうかあんま無理すんな Maybe I've found them all Okay, hang on. He's still being quiet. What? 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 It's, I went to a a convenience store and they didn't have toilet paper, so it's like I don't know what to do. Okay, if you were a stray cat, where would you be? Garbage. <laughs> You'd be a garbage cat. Baba. Yeah, I think I've been along. I guess technically the harbor side was like a batting cage. Okay, you know what street I definitely haven't been down? I haven't been down this street near the cinema. I found one in Chinatown. When am I gonna fight the Red Tiger? I mean, I'm gonna have to, like... Probably after the cat thing, uh, but it's kinda late. I guess that's the thing, is the best way to make experience... ...is at that battle tower, and if I'm going to the battle tower, I guess I have to fight that cat. Alright, I wanna see Adachi's attack, so... What did he learn? Alright, do it. Nelson Strike. Oh, it's, it's like... Ooh, this is single target. This might be very strong. Alright, let's go for the big dude. Get him! Nice. Oh, okay. Alright, that that is that is useful. If that did that to a tanky character, that is an excellent move. My friendship is important. I mean, I was kind of hoping he'd get his own AoE attack, but that's also very good. If it's doing extreme damage to one person... ...that is going to be invaluable. Looks like you've taken your Sujimon collection to the next level. I, I guess that's the side effect of this, is look at this. Okay, I'm more than halfway.
Yeah, the orange quest was great. I want to hear a, a meow. What the? Why? He's level 11, why? What a waste of time. Stop wasting my time. I'm gonna go in here. No, 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 no. Eating. <laughs> Said this before, like, those burgers don't look very good. Why do I keep doing this? <laughs> what? I... I might... <laughs> Am I that tired? <laughs> Walking into glass. <laughs> Ooh, maybe this alley. Aha! Yeah, to meet Skitazi. Okay, jeez, dude. How many? I would assume there's maybe. A couple left. Like, I gotta be at the end of this. You would think. You would hope. I, I can't believe that I have to search basically every street for this. A systematic approach would have worked. I should have... あったあった。no. Ah, you gotta be kidding. What the hell? Where did they come from? This is not worth my time. It interrupted the conversation as well. Systematic approach. Oh, hello. I mean, that's for the real estate mode. I'm sorry this is what this has become today. I really did want to progress. And I really do because the story is at a point where it's like brought back Majima and Saijima. And I want to know why they're at that headquarters. But Majima just beats the ever-living crap out of me and I can't win. Which, I mean, it's... The moment he popped up, I was like, this is going to suck. I mean, I love that he's here, but this fight is going to suck. And I was right. <laughs> it's horrible. Oh, 
ここで働けばお金ももらえて一石二鳥じゃねえか一石二鳥お金稼ぐのともう一つはえそれはその社会貢献どうせならもっとうまいこと言えよ冗談よでもこのバイトはショー見られないわえそこの担当者と知り合いなんだけどバイトはモギリや機材調整係だってああそうなんだそれに下心で門を叩く人はすぐに分かるってさ違うぞ俺は真面目にやらない別に何でもいいけどねな楽な仕事なんてねえよな OK they're not coming that's fine That's kind of wild, like, it's asking for my level to be at that and still not at that, despite being this far into the game. DVD DVD I wonder at what point was someone's gonna ask, like, if you talk about a DVD, someone's gonna be like, what's a DVD? I feel like that time is coming soon. VHS もう長らく見なくなったなえどういうことだどっから説明するか難しいがいろいろ Find the cat I'm trying but there's no hints そ,そうなのか The only thing I can do is comb every part of the city Uh I mean Maybe I'll maybe along here. Look in all the alleys, yeah. Yeah, it's just hard. I have to do this systematically. All right, let's go to this alley. Excellent wayfinding, as always. This had better be a, a worthy reward. Oh. I guess the other thing is I could maybe get a good redeem for the Tojo Crest thing. That might be a side effect of all this. Is Maybe I can summon a cat. That would be worthwhile. Just something that justifies like, the last couple of hours. Oh, it's a part-time hero. Okay, well, that's nice, I guess. ちょっと下限やってかねえか。気晴らししたい気分なんだ。うん。ルールに厳しい家だった。I ゲーム禁止にされちゃったんだけど、やっぱり遊びたいじゃないだから見つからないようにこっそり隠れて遊んでいたんだけど、ビジュアルメモリの電池が切れて、ピーってなってしまって。ドリームキャストをやってたのか
Oh, I guess... Did I play the Saturn? Maybe the Saturn as well. Something I never tried. But I guess that's the era where, like, Sega was, like, starting to... Buckle. Oh, something just occurred to me. What if... I mean, there is an underground for this game. They'd be kind of... Cr well, they've all... Oh. Alright, we're gonna do a nice walk along the river. Oh, you know what? I just thought of somewhere. Oh! Oh! oh irritating me. Dude! What is this? <laughs> Look at the enemies. One pack there, one pack there, one pack there. Like, I can't go anywhere. Calm down. I know this is supposed to be mimicking, like, a real RPG where enemy encounters can be like that sometimes, but... Man. I was gonna check here. Okay, but there's one of these here. This is what we found, Nancy. Most valued team member. They're guarding the cat. <laughs> no, they're not. I would, I would absolutely hate it if that was real. The cat has joined organized crime. I love how earlier I was saying I'm never going to get these Tojo Crests, and now the reality is I probably will. All it took was just, hey, go find some cats. Oh shit, what if they're like... I hope not. I hope they're truly outside. Because you can't... There's no way to know... There's no way to know what you can walk through and can't walk through. Is that a safe? No, I already got it. Hold on. Imagine a quest where you have to pick up a sunflower, but the sunflower is defended by a dragon. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of that stuff. Those quests often are not worth it, but you don't know that until after. I thought for sure it would be here. Ah! Come on! Damn it! Good. I'm 
unfortunately, you know, the smart thing to do would be doing some sort of sound effect. To try and draw a cat in that might be listening, but you can't do that. What a fun stream this has been. I may go see how many of these I have, because there's a really supposed. Hang on, do you have? Okay, we're buying this. Look, at this point, I'm just stocking on heals for tough fights. I still haven't found anyone that scalp. Anyone that sells... No one sells toilet paper in this town. Is, is this a joke because this game was released in 2020, so no one has toilet paper? <laughs> what is this? No joke, the game was released in 2020. What is this? Hey, where do you think you're going? You want me to let you in? Like a dog scratching and begging his master to let him in the house before he freezes to death? I suggest you learn what's good for you and get lost. What is this? Ooh. Hey, what's back there anyway? Well, shit! Most people who try asking Aniki a question end up fumbling their words and leaving in disgrace. But you? You got confidence, brother. That sack must weigh a ton. Uh. Heh, that look in your eyes. It's like a salmon swimming upstream. Not giving a fuck about statistical impossibilities. Alright, I'll show you what's here. Follow me. It's gambling. Oh. Whoa. What you see here is a gambling hall, where Ichinja's more reckless vagrants come to blow off steam, not to mention Cass. Best part is the long dick of the law can't touch it. If you got some money and marbles, blah 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 blah, I don't care. <laughs> Never touching this. Is there a cat down here? If there isn't, I'm out. Should I just look this up? I don't generally like doing that, but this is literally, well, not literally, figuratively, needle in a haystack territory. <laughs> like, it's, it's practically that. I don't know how many are left. I, I'm going to assume at least two. It's definitely at the tail end of it, because I'm, I haven't heard a meow in a while. Have I considered checking the place where they found the quest? There was one nearby, but maybe I should go again just to be thorough. Like, I can't rule it out. I've done things in the past where it's like, I think... I've done something, and then I actually haven't. For example, I finished T Tumba, and I had... I didn't get one achievement, which was to complete all the, um... The events. I had 129 out of 129, there's 130, and I'm like, okay, which one did I miss? And I checked the list, thinking I had done them all, and then one of them... I misread, and I hadn't done, so... Yeah. Okay, while, while this is talking, let's... Let's have a look. Okay, 
Progress doesn't help. Okay. あなたは不思議な人ですよ、カスガさん。損費もあなたのことを高く買っています。私が焼き餅を焼くほどにね。よく言うよ。しのわ、drives it crashes the browser. You can't realistically go on the internet without an ad blocker. Like, it's insane. Okay. Okay. I am paying attention to what's happening. ってことはあんたの今の顔は作り物の顔です。大掛かりな整形手術を受けました。オッケー、ロックサイクターズ1。あとトレイン、トレインステーション。オッケー、there <笑> I think I found commercial district. I found the Sunrise Street one. Apparently there's two at the park, alright. So I think I have the three that I haven't found. Yeah, this would go for hours. This is kind of insane. I guess the answer is that it's not at base. Okay, it's wild to me that these dudes are like in their 30s and 40s. されたされた。30人ほどがね。30。あ、いや、キュリーはインボルドンだ。そう、アジア最大の町でした。その島をめぐる構想は激烈だったと聞いています。ま、アクチュアリー、ザ、ザワンダハペンインザ80s、イズ
21世紀に入って2006年の冬私が二十歳になった頃本国の神言派は日本の極道らに大攻勢を仕掛けますただしその際 When this guy first came into the picture, I thought he was going to be the new Majima. Given in that story, like. Yeah, you know, they were going with Majima was dead. Just because his whole demeanor and his, I guess, hate burner for Kiryu is <laughs> no other way to put it. I thought he was going to become the new Majima, but. He's his own dude. <laughs> so this done it. Dory de Casca Sango, Kirai Narena, you are kiddes. De Jingo Hano Daiko said to no, don't not die. Nagai Jikamo Kakete Kaka Sarate Mastaga, Kiku, Tojo Kaini Tsubusare Masta. Hinikuna Kotoni Sono Tokino Karegamo, Chirijini, whatever a Hagre Jingo Hai Kuava. Okay, so train station. I'm just looking at where these. The likely cats are. That makes sense. The train station's like kind of in the middle and I probably avoided it. Apparently there's two along the train station. Okay. These are probably the ones I'm missing. He's warmed up a lot more to Kasuga than Kiryu. Wait, what? Wait, what? So he's not the he's not the Oh, I, I missed this. Maybe this is the answer to the question. It's like a core account. Oh man, you know what? Kind of is. <laughs> but at least the Koroks is like, okay, that that's a Korok. You can spot it out. This is there's none of that. That's just. <sighs> I just have to look everywhere. Are you Kashiwagi? Wait, who's it pointing to? No, 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 we, no karaoke. A cat mask? That would be funny. Oh, it's you. So, you know, Chanto Jikosho Kaistena Katani. What does you a Yanagi Iroha? Konami said no, that's the Osterno. Aratame Tereskani. Iroha Chanka Kasuga Ichibanda. Yoroshuna. Tetsu de Sikaka? So, what does you know? She got to have that. Stotsua in shock no order or Turkoto. Takara.飲み食いしたい時は私に声かけてね。そしてもう一つはお客さんと話すこと。私実は少し前に他の店でホステスやってて聞き上手のイルハって有名だったの。だから私に何でも話してね。あ、でも話すって言っても何を話せばいいんだ
to have a look. Put this to rest. I'm gonna live dangerously. Okay, we're fine. Emergency lane. I can't believe the train station didn't occur to me. Okay, let's have a look around. It can't go in. So where is it wanting me to go? We'll look around the train station. Where's the meow? Taking a risk. Ah! Ah! That's so annoying. Someone's gonna get hit by a car. It wouldn't bother me so much, but, the, like, none of these dudes are worth the experience, despite them, um, being on a relatively similar level. What the hell? Have I gotten run over? Yes, twice. Okay, almost three times. What is this location? Sorry, give me a sec. Okay, apparently it's here. Which makes sense. Oh, Toja Crest. I'm definitely gonna check in with the Toja Crest um, dude. At this point, I don't think I have 50, but I might be able to get something. Leave me alone! Can I- can I just run? Yeah. Let me hear the meow. Oh my, look at this! <laughs> Dude. In here? Oh, you gotta be kidding. There it is. Okay, I heard the meow. Where? Can't walk in the building. Yeah, <laughs> Unfortunately, it doesn't tell me how many are remaining, but this was one of the ones that I saw. Okay, well, the other location apparently is here. <laughs> I 
I mean, I wouldn't say the entire stream is dedicated to finding the cats, like... I did get my butt kicked for the first, I don't know... Half hour, maybe 40 minutes. Well, um, I complained about my computer for a bit. But yeah, it's, it's, it's been a cat hunt stream. Like, I, I've let this stupid side quest derail what I was trying to do. It's not going to be a good reward. Like, this is one of these things where it's just taken so much time now that it's, it's not going to be a good reward. But I, I've definitely gone past um, the point of no return, and at this point, like, it is truly sunken cost fallacy. Gee, well, what did you get up to Saturday night? Oh, I looked for virtual cats for, like, three hours. In the defense of this game, the rewards have been very good. I don't want to get my hopes up, but... Ha! <sighs> yep. Okay, where? Where is Neko? Oh, there's another crest over here. I suppose that's the side effect of this, is I have... At least double the amount of Tojo crests I have. Does anyone see it? I hear you, don't see you. Oh, there's more in here. Hang on, it might be in there. No, no, it's probably in, in that hidden area there. Okay. There you are. Is, is that all of them? That's all of them. Okay. <laughs> Done. <laughs> I'm sorry this took so long. Ugh, it's not the worst wild goose chase I've been on. Like, I've subjected people to worse. At least I progress four levels. You know what? True. I, did, I didn't notice that my levels went up that much. I'm... I made part of the journey to making that Majima fight less of a nightmare. I didn't even see that until now. This is like the kind of training they would do in Dragon Ball. Old Kai would like, get them to do something very menial and stupid and you'd question if it was even training and then... Suddenly it's like, wait, why am I so strong? Like, this, this is the training. The secret training. He let the cats out on purpose, so then I would become stronger. If you think about it, I've run across an entire city. Alright, what's the reward? <laughs> I'm afraid to find out. My babies, you're all okay. Thank you again, Kasuga-san. I'm forever in your debt. It's all good. A part-time hero got to do what a part-time hero does. It makes me so happy that you took the request. Here, this is for you. Uh, 
Um, not- Oh, no, th that was a mil- it's a million. It got me a million in cash, that's- that's actually kinda worth it. Oh. I've gotten word that Robson Chan has returned to the city. Who the hell is Robson Chan? Uh. Robson Chan was my first cat, he was an- Are you kidding me?! <laughs> I have to go find another cat! I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose my mind. He was an active little guy and he never liked how clingy he was. One day he left me. Isn't usually isn't it usually the other way around? I never meant to be so clingy, but I want to see him again one last time. He was my first kitty after all. Please, Kasuga san, would you find Robson Chan for me? I I can't. I can't. So I can make peace with the little guy. Uh, sure. I'm looking. I'm sorry. I'm looking this up. I'm not about to like spend another two hours looking for another cat. He would go where most cats wouldn't dare. Okay. I don't care if this is a spoiler, like... There is no quest marker, so it's it's just... Oh, I... You mean... Look for every nook and cranny, you mean what I... Ugh. Robson... Tom... Cat. Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna look around the whole city again. No. Like, that's not about to happen. Do you know how long it took to get to this point right here? I'm surprised people are still watching. <laughs> like, I would. It's- it's going to- It's going to approach the territory of, like, the worst thing I- I did on stream once. Which was... I was trying to get all the Platinum Relics in- in the Crash Bandicoot trilogy. The, uh, the remake one. So Crash Bandicoot 1 never had... Relics, time trial relics in the original. So some of them were very bad. There was one in particular where it took me four and a half hours to get to a point where, like, I was going to make it, and then I messed up the last jump. And I don't think I've ever been so angry at a game ever. But the, the reason I'm telling you this is because it was a four and a half hour investment, maybe more. Collectively, probably closer to six when I came back next time and continued hitting my head against that brick wall. But... There was always a reminder of, like, if I'm ever being so stubborn in a quest, or doing something that is taking forever, I just remind myself of that- that stream. And, uh, cause I promised myself I just would not let it get to that point ever again. And this is, this is dangerous, this is on the edge of that territory, it's like, it's been about three hours of cat hunting. Tenacity, it was tenacity for sure, but it was borderline stubbornness. It's a good thing there's not really any footage of that stream, other than maybe some random clips, but... Like, I was making horrendous noises, I was doing horrible voices. And then at a certain point I was playing yodely, yodeling music because I was so sick and tired of hearing the same 40 second loop... ...of that stage's music. I, I, I've said this before, like, you know, that was very early days of streaming, and there's no footage for it, so, you know, I kind of want to do that trilogy again and do go through that ordeal. However, it wouldn't happen anytime soon. <laughs> this is how bad it was. Crash, the Crash Bandicoot 1 attempts and, you know, 100%ing that game. 
I did it, and then I didn't play Crash Bandicoot 2 until maybe a couple years later. That's how much of a break I needed before I could even consider going to the second game. But then, you know, the third one was pretty much right away, because they weren't nearly as tedious as the first. I'm sure it was better than the recorder. No, this will- oh! Alright then. This must be Hiro-san's first cat. Robson-chan, at last. Found your little feline butt. You know, you shouldn't really worry your owner like that. Too bad you don't speak human. That's the thumbnail right there. <laughs> that's the thumbnail. This is all, this is all that's happened. Because Rick, Rick and Morty was big at that point. I think at a certain point I was doing like a Rick Sanchez voice. Just saying how they ruined the game. The problem with that game was... Because it was, um... You know, a remake. They tried to do the same level layouts, but the problem was because the geometry was like different. The jumps... There were times that you would just slip. It's kind of hard to explain, but like, you know... Imagine I'm standing on the rail, right? As Crash Bandicoot. And then I jump. In the original Crash, you could just keep jumping on the same spot because you're safe, right? In the trilogy, you jump and then you have like a 50-50 chance of slipping. So, the level I was struggling on required you to jump along this railing to avoid, um, you know, slowing down too much, but the railing had a very strong chance of slipping. So you can imagine how horrible it was. I don't think I've ever been more upset at a video game, like... No, no kidding. The, uh, the very, very last jump... After four and a half hours of losing my mind... I knew it was gonna make it. And then... The slip happened on the very last jump. And I yelled. I yelled, it hurt my vocal cords. And even afterwards, like, I was seething. I'm a pretty calm person, you know? I mean, don't get me wrong, I got salty. But often it's in the name of comedy. Oh, I can't even take a cab there, like, I have to walk. That's kind of I guess that's why I never went up that side of the map, is there's just no... Alright, we're going back. Worse than ice. Yeah, I mean... Kind of the best way to describe it, actually. There are very few games that have, have made me that angry. And that is... is one of those times that's just like, I don't think I've, I've been that upset at a game before. That and cart races, like, I think cart races is probably the time I get the most salty. Just because RNG.
One game that came very close was um, Ghosts and Goblins. <laughs> that game came dangerously close to like a, me getting unreasonably angry at it. You never heard of that game? It's a very old series. It was like on the NES, the Super Nintendo, it was on Sega. And then they did a uh, like a new entry a few years back. I'd never played any of them, but you know, it was one of those things that I felt confident that I could finish one. And I got through the main story. Right? But then there's like a I guess, uh, haha, JK, do it again, but this time it's harder. And I refused to do that. I was like, nope, I'm good. It's like... How Dark Souls is always referred to as, like, you know, the pinnacle of difficulty, and it's always comparing. You know, like, if something's really hard, they'll go, oh, it's the Dark Souls of, uh, like, that genre or whatever. But I'm pretty sure Dark Souls was, like, inspired by games like Ghosts and Goblins. Ghosts and Goblins is way harder than Dark Souls. There's so much about that game where, like, it has been meticulously designed to screw you over at every turn. And the only other game that has done that to me and has made me that unreasonably angry was Splunky 2. Like, that game, it, evil, evil, fun and evil game. I spent six months of my life trying to, like, finish the, um, the big final thing you, you do in that game. Uh, it was hell trying to catch him. I couldn't find him anywhere. And here again, Kasuga-san. And just look at you, robson John. The two of you together, I have, an, I have an idea. I think it'll be a great... Are we getting a cat summon? Say what? Well, you've taken care of so many part-time hero requests, some of which are very demanding. If you ever feel like you can use a cat by your side. Robinson John will answer the call. I know it. As long as you stick to being a cat person. Alright, worth it. Come on, Robinson John. Give me a big welcome back hug. If you want if you want a laugh and you want to see me get very angry, like definitely the Splunky the Splunky streams. I think there's like 90 something VODs of that shit. <laughs> it's just. Sometimes it's just me getting my ass kicked for four hours and getting nowhere. What about keeping the pace and s peace and safety seat? I'm sure Robinson will come back once he sees what you can do. Oh, he's. There he is. Yeah. You're right, Kazuka son. I must be strong. That being said, let's continue to work together for the peace and safety of the city. Okay, I mean, I want to say that the last... Jeez, it's like four hours now. <laughs> uh. Alright, we have closure. I'm content. But yeah, on stream, Crash Bandicoot Trilogy and Splunky 2. Those are the times that I, I got really angry. I haven't been here. I was gonna go check in with the Tojo dude, but... Whoa. 
I think that's a game that I, I will n not play again, unless they have new content for it, which they haven't. Or a sequel. But I, I can't do that to myself again, just... The process of achieving that final goal, like, it, it's insanity. To even have a chance of achieving that final goal, right, it's effectively... You have to do very specific things, not die, and that pro that initial process to even get to the point where you're attempting that final thing takes about 40 minutes every time. And then when you finally get in there, to get to the very end, it, can, it took me about, what, three hours? And the entire time you're walking on eggshells, like, that game is... You could enter a particular room and then something could happen that's completely not your fault and it'll murder you and you just have to kind of have situational awareness to the point where you're like okay you're prepared and you're taking things in a very surgical manner but there are so many times where i died in that game where it's just like i had nothing to do with my death it was just the game going well screw you time to die <laughs> uh but I don't know, there was something about it that just kept me coming back to it. I mean, I'm a, I'm a masochist. I know this. You can blame Zelda 1 for that. Um, where is this place? There. This is where I need to go. The weird thing is I never played the original. I've been tempted to go play the original, but then it's like, well... Apparently that has its own... ordeal. I actually had a good lunch today. Just thinking about food. <laughs> one of the burgers... One of the burger places that, um... Uh, it's, it's pretty decent here in Australia. Um, they're known to do, like, healthier burgers, but they do this very good... Fried chicken kind of alternative. But they had like a spicy version of it today and it was pretty good. And they had this blueberry yuzu soda. It was like, um, fried chicken sandwich, I'm gonna say. For understanding. But it's a burger. <laughs> Um, oh man, that was good. Had like this pretty good hot sauce on it. Cheese. Pickles, it was good. But the chicken was, was very well done. Don't worry, I'm not going to do the whole thing where I'm questioning, like, why call it a chicken sandwich. I should probably use the new move. Whoa, what is going on there. I guess she has nowhere to move. Yeah, see, this is the concerning part, is... You love burgers. They're good, but the Like, a, a once every now and then sort of thing. If adding pineapple on pizza is a war crime. I mean, to Italians. Not... To everyone. What does pineapple on a sandwich become? I mean, there's nothing wrong with pineapple on a sandwich. 
There's a fast food place here in Australia that does, like, oven roast chicken. Um, and they have a pack called the Tropical Pack. That's, uh, you know, a quarter piece of chicken, fries, and then a pineapple fritter, which is just like a battered piece of pineapple that's deep fried. And that's a, a pack you can get here. The pineapple fritters are actually pretty decent. I like them. Okay. I don't know how many... I have 36. Okay, 14 and then... See, there's nothing that is... What is this thing? Who would use it? This seems like something Kasuga would use. Oh no, there it is. Yeah, Kasuga. And everyone can use it. Apparently. Attack is 135. Um, hold on. Let's just see if it's even worth it. It's not worth it. It's, I already got something that's like attack 135. That being said, it paralyzes. I guess it's kind of nice, but it's it's not worth seeking out. Maybe it has a cool visual effect, but... Given, you know, I've spent... <laughs> about four hours looking for cats, I'm not gonna <laughs> spend four hours looking for tiny badges around the city. I'm lucky I found this many, and it's just a side effect of um, hunting down the cats. Oops. How much money do I have? Um, eh, I guess that's the other thing. Okay, I'm gonna eat. Yeah, I need to heal her. Stop! <laughs> Leave me alone! Actually, this, eh, this fight's probably worth it. It's like high... High level. Alright, we go all out. Okay, good. Are they... Uh, hang on, let them... This might get him. Nice! Alright, Adachi Slam. I don't like this weapon. It's not making the same comedic slap that the other weapon made. It just make me laugh every time. Just, yeah, I don't know. There's, there's something about the sound that that weapon made. ちょっと痩せようかと思ってたからちょうどいいぜ。本当どういうことするのか。だって、ああ。スリビアライン。ですなわざ。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもないと。でもない
back in Sedenbori. Um, well, yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah, no, what's that? Start a What the hell are you? Uh-oh, he's got a special theme. Whoa, that's a new move. Whoa. There's a new heal move he's got. I didn't even notice some of the stuff. I doubt fire's a weakness here, so let's just test it out. Yeah, resistant. This will get rid of the status affliction. It's fine. Alright. Give him the full Nelson. That, I mean, given this a special fire, that did quite a bit. Okay, um, I'm guessing it's not worth, hold on. No, give it to Adachi. We're doing another Adachi slam. Let's see if this works. Yeah, I mean, look, probably a good idea. Uh, what can I do here? Let's just... Okay. It's time. Nelson! Okay, ow. Alright, let's try this. Where is he? There he is. Well, I mean, I came here for fights, so... The cat? Um, I guess it depends what it does, but I, I don't want to use it for this, because it seems manageable. Well, I already have to eat. Speaking of eating, I'm surprised there isn't a... There's usually, like, a food-related minigame. There's some restaurant owner that typically got Kiryu to cook. I'm surprised that hasn't happened. Damn it, I'm an idiot. Oh. You know what? I might be able to get the 14 this way. Maybe I can get this weapon. I mean, there's only 12 remaining. I didn't even consider that Sodenbori would have these. Don't you dare interrupt me! <laughs> God. 
Okay, but this is actually worth fighting because they're in their 40s. That was a good move. The way I say 40s implies they're old. I meant level 40, not like age 40. I can't exactly make fun of someone for being old because I'm getting to that point. <laughs> I'm not quite there yet, but it'll happen one day. Wait, what is this? I got baited. I thought this... Oh, no, hang on. Oh, come on. <laughs> what is this? I didn't even consider that these could be inside buildings as well. Okay, 11 remain. As far as getting that fancy weapon. Which, though not an up... I guess technically an upgrade still because it inflicts status. Okay, 10. I think I can find 10 pretty easily. Oh yeah, no, we're not going there. Briefcase. I love, again, just another wild goose chase. There's probably one in here. Or that. There we go, nine. It's only because I haven't been actively looking in in this area. Would there be one in here? Let's have a look. Yep. What is that? Eight now? I have good odds of finding it because it's not like, you know, I'm finding all of them. I'm just finding enough to afford that big weapon. What is this? Oh, is that another one? Yep. Seven. the heck? Six. And a Christmas tree. Number one? Ball or die? Why do you want to kill me? Can't actually kick it. Okay. Then the ball is set to the goal. This would actually suck. <laughs> he would kick it off the building constantly. Hello, Yukichi-kun. 
ゴール裏のせいで蹴れねえとはアウェイの洗礼ってやつだな PK って難しいぜ Then when I open this, could it would interrupt it. That might be an upgrade for someone. We'll see. Oh, that wasn't one. Everything here. Maybe. Nani, Kono Bill. That's then to stay there, Choco. So, this girl, she can't take his lady, Saturday, you only me, must know. No, 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 そう感じるんだろうな。What a fun-filled treasure hunt. Um, have I? Yeah, no, I came this way. Okay, we're going this way. It shouldn't take me that much longer because this city I haven't really been in. And I haven't act. Yeah, see, there's another one. Oh, wait, no, that's not it. And because of that, it's probably easy to find the minimum I need. What's the. Hmm. I think I'm imagining it. That's gotta be one. Yes, okay. Sticks, I would assume. Aha. Uh -huh. I keep accidentally stumbling into casinos. I'm not gonna play, I'm good. Oh, there we go. I knew it, there had to be one in here. How many is that now? Forty-six. Four more. We can do this. I'm <laughs> just looking for items. Well, if you haven't seen the city, get to know it now. Wait, what in the Saki told his garino Obachanka, Nichan, I mean, I guess you just have to be in the know if you're gonna find those casinos. Oh, nice. Two more. One more. Uno mas. Okay. Come on. 
There has to be one around here somewhere. Like a pretty isolated corner. What about up the stairwell? Oh, you can't go up the stairwell. Yes! Is that it? I'm pretty sure that's it. No, it's not. 49. I miscounted. In my defense, I sh should be in bed. <laughs> okay, there we go. 50. Alright. Let's go get Kasuga's work. I guess it doesn't necessarily have to be Kasuga's. Whoever gets the most benefit out of it. Is it even... Uh, we'll see. Okay. We are going to... I'm still not strong enough to face him. I'll, I almost get the feeling like I need to get the next armor tier, because uh, that fight was just that insane, just how much damage he was doing. Oh yeah, I gotta hop back in. So now we gotta go over here. Ugh. This is the first time a fight in one of these games has, like, really beat me that badly. Hang on, are you trying... What are you doing? Oh. There we go. Got it. Wait, what is it? Who's it for? It's not here. Did I just waste my time? <laughs> traffic wand, traffic wand. I said it was equipable by everyone, so what? what is it exactly? What? Am I going crazy? What is it? Sucker of Storm. Renowned Blade. Job. Oh, it's for a job that I don't even have. Alright, well that was a waste. <laughs> How about I switch jobs so I can just use that weapon? I thought it was for the... Ugh, whatever. It, it just says... That any of them can use it. I guess any of them can have that job. Alright. Good. No, I love the part where I actively looked for more things and it was pointless. <laughs> uh. Mm. 
and on the bright side, I'm feeling a bit better about the level now. Though not enough to do the fight, at least this town isn't going to kick my butt. Oh, you've got them myself. All right. Nelson. It's a good move, given how much it uses and how much it does. It's not that expensive a move and it does quite a bit of damage. I mean, I want to be healed for this. Oh, crap. They're, they've... It doesn't matter. I'm not going to do that today. <laughs> They're almost at their next bonding level. ここ最近で一番悩んだ顔してるぞ。孫飛から美味しいお土産を買ってくるよう頼まれたのですが、たこ焼きもお好み焼きも持って帰るのは難しいですから。適当なお菓子じゃダメなの？こういうところで手を